is Az reporting for BuzzNet, live at the Roxy, and I'm here with... White Star. Oh. Oi! <laughs> Would you guys introduce yourselves? I'm Tony World, renowned greatest dancer. Hello. I'm Cisco, I sing. I'm Rainbow. What do you do? I play guitar. I'm Orby, I'm my own mic. Yes, I play drums. Do my own play bass, formerly known as Chandler, actually. <laughs> I'm Zaz and I interview. Tell us about your live shows. They're known to be pretty wild and have a score full of <laughs> ladies there. Yeah, they do have ladies. They'll be here tonight. Um, with live, we're just a fucking we're a live band. I think we we pride ourselves on that. You know, we all can play. We actually can play. No one else is playing our parts in the fucking studio except his. Someone else comes in and dances his parts <laughs> and grunts and moans and complains. Who are you guys playing with tonight? Tonight, I'm a robot. Nice. nice. It's going to be a good yeah, show. Yeah, great band. Another L.A. band. Our homies for a long time, and um, we never got to play with them over, like, literally five years. We've but kind of started even at the same time, I feel like. Tell us about the rabbit. My stepdad, when I was a kid, I had a pet rabbit, and, um, and, he, and he got loose, and he started taking shits on the floor, like those little round ones. Rabbit and they go, like in, they go like in, like, there's like a whole line of them. And I'm like, fuck. And I couldn't, <laughs> and I really couldn't get the shit up fast enough. And my stepdad came home, Richard, he was like a white trash dude, like a meth addict. And he fucking um, took my rabbit. He said, come with me. He was like really nice. And he's like, I was like, oh, cool. Oh, cool. Guys, I thought he was going to teach him how to like take his shit outside. Then he just, there was a big white wall the side of a, of a building, and he just took the rabbit and threw it against yeah. it. And then it, <laughs> and and then it, and it went down like this. The stepson. Blood. Just blood everywhere. <laughs> how much of a factor is the internet? With your Giant. With your band. Almost got to be 80%. 80%. I was just going to say that. It's just created a situation where you can get to everyone without having to get to them. So, you know what I mean? So, it really, I guess it weeds out the stuff that's good and bad anyway or that people are responding to. So, it's just another way that you don't have to, like, get in a van and do that. The Internet has made it so you just go on the Internet and just get what you want. You know what I mean? It's like... The 50s again. You just get like one song. I think you know what it's made it. It's made it a lot easier for bands. You know what I mean? If they're on their shit and they and they really utilize it, it's a fucking brilliant tool. Potato, dancer, <laughs> lawyer. Where did you go to law school? <laughs> um, that whole law thing. Open your eyes, potato. The uh, he's a sleepy dude. <laughs> I don't even remember the question. Oh, went to I went to law school in L.A. Yeah, it's an interesting story, but let's talk about the best dancing. Just keep them open. I'm a good. Interview, I'm a really good dancer. <laughs> I'm a really good dancer. Okay. I got a lot of energy. I work out like four times a week.